What's up for you, mate? Hey guys, what's up? I am here with my little friend, Mr. Robert Oberst. Uh, we are on the road right now, actually working on a filming project that we can't talk about. But it's gay porn. <laughs> well, <laughs> maybe for you on the side. I don't know, dude. <laughs> Gotta make the money, man. Yeah. Um, but uh, we've had a long day of filming. Bottom line, it's been crazy long. Um, we're both pretty tired, but we both have goals to accomplish in the sport of strongman. So, um, unfortunately, even though we're tired, it's been a long day. We still got to put the work in uh, and get some training in here while we're on the road because uh, uh, that work doesn't stop. So, um, we're gonna have some fun. How you feeling? I'm I'm beat. Like yeah, yeah, we, it's been it's been like 12, 13 hours on our feet, and um, people don't understand like filming. It's a different kind of exhaustion. Exactly. We're used to coming in here and beating ourselves up. But doing this like stand here and, and repeat yourself 400 times stuff, it's, it's a different kind of exhaustion, but there's no excuses, you know? And, and, and we're uh, here to be great. That's it, baby. That's it. So we're gonna get to work. We'll bring you guys along for a ride. Hopefully you enjoy the video. Give it everything you got! Uh, let's, I mean, it's, we can jump the coop because that, that log is lighter. Yeah. With this, uh, with this video, we're not going to be able to say the exact weight of the log because we don't know. It's an unknown. So I think we're guessing what around eight, Three, 400 pounds. <laughs> just round up. We're just going to round up. It's about, yeah. about 400 pound log. Yeah. World record warming up. Oh. Yeah. We're going to say somewhere, uh. I think it's like 60 to 85. Like yeah, definitely, definitely less than 100. Oh yeah, for sure, for sure. The, the, I was talking about the first time I ever competed was at your show in Colorado. And I, I lived at sea level at the time. Yeah. And I was like, I am f***ing ready for this. Like, I'm going to come in, I'm going to murk these dudes. Like, I'm going to kill everyone. And you told me that when you showed up. <laughs> I know. I, I was like, my name is, my name is Robert. <laughs> And I'm gonna win this show. <laughs> you were fucking pressing in here on ice style. Why are you going to be? I didn't know that you were threw it out the door. So anyway, random, random snowball apparently in the gym. <laughs> I'm, I'm guessing that was Mr. Edwin Hall. I need attention, Hall. Yeah, yeah. Anyways, that first show, yeah, I, I trained at sea level. And I showed up and I told you, I was like, I'm here, I'm gonna win. And you were like, yeah, okay. Like, yeah. I'm sure you've heard that before. Yeah, no, I was I yeah. meant it. Yes, and oh, then yeah. that first event, it was a load medley. I remember. I like, oh yeah. my God. Yeah. Like two of the four of, of implements, I got done, I turned around and I like almost blacked out. Yeah, yeah, the elevation, 100%. Yeah, Rex. Yeah, it, was, yeah. it was a good lesson. Like yes. honestly, that was my first lesson. Like you, you gotta fucking work. It's different, different situation, overcome, overcome obstacles. Like yeah. ice on the wood. Yeah, if I slip, I'm going to fight him. And you yeah. can record that. If yeah, I yeah. slip here, I'm going to go fight him. I feel like we probably both should. Yeah. You know? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> It'll be a tag team. Tag team. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Man. Let's go. Crooked, so that's why it came up in this way. Because instead of being here, a little bit off. Yeah. It's Which little... pressing it actually helps you get a little more pop, but in this cage, yeah. kind of fucks you over. Yeah. It's it's a little bit annoying, but whatever. We'll make it happen. Easy off. Come on. Come on. Good. Good. Easy. Good job. How's that 
feel. That's good. Um, it's like low threes, I think. I don't know, it's hard to guess. It's hard to guess. Yeah. Perfect reps. Come on. There it is. There it is. Nice. Way better, way better felt there. Find a rhythm. Yeah. <coughs> what do you think? Three, okay. There you go. Set yourself. Nice. Nice. How's it going? Yeah. Really good. How often do you like try and make sure you stay strict? Because I notice even on weights that are easier for you, you still like to pop. Is that because you want the rhythm of the pop or I've uh, in all honesty, I've I've I, I for a little while I was I was training um, strict more strict log press. Yeah. And um, really trying to push the weights up with it. And what I found for me at least personally is that I started getting in a very bad habit of the initial press. I would lean more yeah. and I would press away to try to get my chest involved more. Right. And I got in a bad, bad position. Yeah. So it was, then I would try to go back to using my legs yeah. and my position was terrible. So I just didn't feel like for me there was a connection between trying to do a strict log press and then trying to incorporate the legs because my line yeah. Everything was just messed up. That makes sense. So I'll kind of, I mean, some of the lighter weights, I won't obviously use my legs as much or anything. Right. And it's not. But I notice you still have that rhythm, even with the light weights, that you can easily throw up. Yeah, it's just a habit. It's I like think, a, honestly, because I, I went both ways with it. I used to do all strict, but I still, when I, even when I press, I don't use a ton of leg. You're you're but, more of a, you're more of a strict presser. Yeah. Anyway. Right, and that's just. I think using I think my legs worse. more is a good idea, though, because yeah. I've been thinking along those lines already. Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, anytime, anytime. I mean, think how big of muscles you have down there. Right. Like, the more you can use your legs, and I'll find, I'll even find myself though at times, like as the weight gets a little bit heavier, I'll, I'll do a set, and it's like, man, I, I did more of a strict press yeah. because the pressing has got stronger. Yeah. But it's it's just kind of uh, you know I'll I'll go back and. and Every set, sometimes I'll watch a video or something and say, hey, I need to get some more legs into this or whatever. Yeah. Um, but it's, uh, yeah, it's just kind of, everybody's a little bit different, you know? And you could, your, your position is different than mine. Yeah. And you're, you're you know, it's just, you're gonna be strong in different places. Right. You know, and for me, that line is very important, yeah. right? So I can, I can do a big, bigger weight and feel like it's nothing if it's in the right line. And if I get it out of line, it feels soft. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So it's, and I think the log, just because of the diameter of it, is even more uh, of a problem. You know? It's easier to get it out. I've always, for me, I've always found it easier to press an axle, mm -hmm. um, just, just because it, it's more in line with my body. Yeah, so I, I, mean, I was, you know, I mean, for, for a, a, not a very long time, I had the axle world record in overhead, yeah. which a lot of people have forgot about <laughs> a long time ago. I mean, that was probably 2000, what was that, 2009? I think I did uh, like 410 pounds. Nice. But it was, you know, for being kind of uh, categorized as a weak presser. It was like something that people- People categorize you as a weak presser? Dude, I, I, well, I you, could, read, you could read, read somewhere online that you're weak in anything, right? Yeah, but I think it's just because you never, like you would do the deadlift competitions, but you wouldn't do the press competitions. That's it. And that's yeah. what it is, which by the way, this year, Brian's gonna try and take my American record in log press. I just read this the other day. He's gonna, <laughs> he's gonna try and take my record. I was, which, I was gonna bring that up. And I'm, the punch. I am not letting that go without a fight. I promise you. I promise you that the record's gonna go up. Yeah. I don't know who's gonna end up with it, but <laughs> it's gonna be fun. It, it, it will be. It will be a lot of fun. I was I was there when uh, when Obers broke that record. In that Australia, day, right? Yeah, we were both there. Um, and, and he got he got the record that day, set the new American record. So um, it'll be a lot of fun. Like I've actually been, we haven't had a max log since. Never, right? then. Well, we haven't had one together. Together, no. where where we could have broke the uh, American record. So yeah. 
Yeah, it's, it's going to be, that'll be a lot of fun. I'm actually looking forward That's, to it. I'm excited too. Yeah. I'm just glad yeah. there's someone like an American to push to now. Yes. I'm, I'm feeling good. You're feeling good. Yeah, it's it's going to be fun. It, it's going to be fun. Yeah. A little, a little wholesome competition. <laughs> I'm going to Nancy Kerrigan him. Like. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Good control. There it is. Nice, how's it going? Yeah, I felt all right. I think our rhythm's catching it finally. It's been a long day, man. I know, and it takes a minute <laughs> to shake that off. What do you think? I'm, I'm good. I'm good to go up, like whatever. Well, I mean, realistically, how much you want to go? I'd say a quarter. So that'll be... Who the fuck knows? Yeah. Like, what are we at? Uh, 90. 180, 100 to be 370. 370. We're like we're probably at like 350, 60, 70 ish right there. Okay. So we put another another quarter on there. We're still <coughs> low fours. Okay. Is that cool? Yeah. Uh, let's do um, let's do a. I want to get a couple working sets in. Yeah. So I, I would, for me, I, I'll I'll do a 10 and a five, and then maybe a like a 25 and a five jump or something like that. Okay. Like a 30 pound jump, 30 pound jump instead of a bigger. Okay. It's up to you though. What, well, it depends how many working sets you want to do. Because I want to match your working sets. Probably two more, maybe. Two more? Two or three. Yeah. I think I'm going to go a quarter then. Okay. Because I'm, I'm thinking two more working sets. But I'd like to, if I can hit with a quarter easy, I'd like to feel four plates ish. Man, I don't need to do that. I'm, I'm getting bro right now. Cause I I'm know like, you are. I know. I'm feeling it. I, I have I, this. I, 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 I'm seeing what's happening. It's, it's not, it's not, it's, it's not. <laughs> he, he brings up the log press record and all of a sudden he's like, hey, hey, let's, why don't we test the max? If I went in here today, <laughs> no, that's not, I'm, I'm, I'm just thinking in, I'm thinking in bad terms. Yes, yes let's do, let's do a 10 and a 5. Yes. You are correct. Well, I've got in, in, so first, first I've got, as you guys know, I brought it up before, but I've got, I've got the Arnold first and that's a, that's going to be a log for reps. So right now, that's that's the the training priority, and then we'll drop down to right. a single. And we can, I mean, we can't spoil all the fun on this video, right? No, now. and I don't, and we're not going to max training. anyways. I just I started feeling good. Yeah. And then like the pre workout kicks in. I know, I know, I know. And, and I'm a meathead. Like I fuck around, but I'm a meathead. This is this is this is the trouble, and this is what I talk to you guys about all the time, and you know this. I say training is training and competing is competing. And yes, we are, even though we are competing and we're going to push each other, we're still training. Right. And, and it's that's... easy, it's easy to get out of that lane, believe me. And this is, you guys know too, if you go to the gym, some of you that train strong, man, because I did this for a long time and it's a big mistake, is maxing on something like the log every time you train it. Right. Big, big mistake. I so, made the mistake of doing that with deadlift for a long time. Yes. And I'm not, normally I've got that figured out, I just... Sometimes you get lost in it, and it's good to have someone like this you be like, problem. all right, yeah. calm down, calm yeah. down. It's, we, already, we already know we're both Put strong. Put another right? plate on there. <laughs> yes. Get him. Nice. Get him. Good work. Really good. Good shit. So good. First one you just did, the last one you just did. You got a little bit more amped up for that one. Yeah. Nice. Me too. One more set? I think so, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you burn after? You want to do a burn? I don't normally, but I will. I will, yeah. I like, you mean just kind of like a drop down, do some reps? Yeah. Just, I like know. to come down a lot. Yeah. Like, I like, we'll do our like heavies. A set of what, 10, 12? Even more. Oh, yeah? Yeah. 
Okay. A, a, like a, a set or two of 15 plus. All right. I don't normally do that, but we don't have a lot of time because the gym is going to close. Right. So we're kind of pushing. And uh, yeah, bro. Okay. I'm up for a new challenge. Yeah. So I think honestly, uh, it feels like like the denser I can get my shoulders, the more stable they are. Okay. And I've learned that that actually like amplifies density a lot. Okay. <clears throat> I mean, I've, I've definitely done drop sets, maybe not quite to that rep pattern. Right. But uh, yeah, like I said, Ron, this is something different. It's different day, nice. different challenge. Let's do it. Let's go. Let's go. <clears throat> get the fuck up. Come on. Let's go, Overs. Give me something. <clears throat> Give me something. Let's go. Get it. Huh? Come on. Come on. Nice. Nice and tight. Let's go. Drive it up. Yes, sir. Good. Come on. You got it. You got it. Yup. Good. Come on. Come on. Come on. Up, up, up. Good job. The 10 inch diameter kind of fucked with me a little. It popped up and went like this. Yeah, went out, went out. So Brian bent the log. Dick move. Uh, <laughs> I feel like you might have done that on purpose. <laughs> Just to make my set a lot harder. <laughs> I was coming down and it just, it felt awkward. I'm, the 10 inch, which like we said, it's good to practice with different shit. It came down and I expected it to hit faster. So it like messed me up. Yeah. This is, this is going to be, this is going to be gnarly is what this is going to be for me. Yeah. I'm worried about the clips because we've got these little baby clamps holding onto the bent bars. Well, I mean, I, I want to do it, but like, just just talk to me if uh, if, yeah, I'll if they're if they're going. Like, just say, hey, Brian, put it down, you know. Yeah. Uh -uh. This guy sabotage. I didn't mean to. Yeah. Nancy Kerrigan. <laughs> he, he said that earlier. <laughs> he did say that earlier. He's, he's putting these obstacles in front of me. I've just got to knock them down. <clears throat> All right, let's Let's go! Yeah! Come on, on this shit, be on it. Let's go. Easy. Yeah. You're too strong. Come on. Oh. There we go. Let's go. Easy. Again. Stabilization of the too. Yeah, I felt good. I think I think mine looked way better. <laughs> hey, you you guys comment. You, you tell me that log's bent for me, man. Great, <laughs> no more fun. Everybody, stop working. Everybody, Pay stop working. Pay attention to Eddie. Eddie, do you, do you uh? You still know what this is. This is called Strongman. That's called a, a log press. Yeah. Something I was better than you at. Is that, I, is I that right? The last log press. How did that go? Mm. Very well. I uh, beat the uh, American British record by two kilos, I believe. You did? Mm -hmm. That was your last log press, huh? Yep. I, I, I remember your last log press ending up in your face and you crying in the back. No, I definitely didn't cry in the you back. Didn't cry. No, I wasn't crying. So who, you, you crying. who won? Me. I believe, I believe Bibby. <coughs> I believe Bibby won. Yeah. A real good one, 213. In, in English, uh, two, two, Eddie just said 213, just to clarify, which is roughly uh, 470 pounds? 76? 473? 73. Something like that. Yeah. Something like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right before he went in the back and cried. Mm -hmm. Crocodile your, what, tears. Sorry, what's your PV? Crocodile tears. What's your PV? Exactly what you got, 213. No, it's not. 
Yeah, it is. No, Google it. Google it. In Australia, you did it. You did 212, you fucking Google it. 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 We were all in Australia. We were all there. Who won the contest? No, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. wait, wait, wait. We're talking about long press. No, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. So, okay. first, first. I'll get to my point. Okay. First, who won? You won. I did first place. And who wait, wait, second wait. Place? Whoa, 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 whoa. Out of you two, who placed higher? Wait, wait. Who set, who set, who set the world record in the deadlift? I did. Who okay. set the American record in the long press? Uh huh. Two twelve. And then out of you two, who got who got higher in the placings yes. in the final? Uh, me. Exactly. Where's, Thank you. Where's your trophy, though? Exactly. Where's your trophy? <laughs> did you? <laughs> where's your trophy? The problem is, did you get a trophy from that contest? Did Obus get a trophy from that contest? He, d he did. No, he didn't. I did. There you go. Yes, I did. Where is it? It's at my house. What position is it? What position? It's third. And you were in. You can't call first. third place a trophy. It's not even worth, not even worth mentioning. Technically, it's not even worth technically you got handed a trophy. You got handed, you got you were, you got handed what, a medal. You, were you, got what, hand, you got handed a participation you, you medal. Were what, we'll get to something better for you. These guys are hard to interview. Yeah, yeah. You got fourth place, you got third place. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, yeah, exactly. How many, uh... You can I mean, be honest, how many world strongest men no, no, I was gonna say, I was gonna say international strongman, pro strongman contest, first places. I've done none. I think the only one, That's only, a lie. Worlds. the only internationals I've done is worlds. That, that escalated quickly, <laughs> is what that did. I was trying to both, give them both something. And they, 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 they kind of took it, and then the Oberst, I, I feel like, went a little bit too far. <laughs> I have to! I, I have mean, to! I'll, I'll bring up this point. Oberst was bringing up a different name than his own. And Eddie stayed in his lane. I, feel like, I feel like Eddie won that argument. Yeah. No, he didn't win the argument. You I to, just had to go too far to win the to argument. Bring, you had to like bring on your side to beat me. No, I didn't bring him on my side. I put him over you. But all I'm, I agree with you, I went too far. I agree with you. I'm not even bothered anyway. No, I'm fine with that. I had to go too far didn't to win the argument. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I didn't even know what I was gonna say. I just started talking. And yeah, yeah. That's how it happened. And then it just comes out. It just comes out. What do you, how many wins are you trying to do? The, the funny part is these guys need to argue about how many wins and this and that and whatever. I don't, I don't ever need to talk about that. I, 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 Nobody I, likes you, all right? Yeah. Stop it. <laughs> and that's what happens. Because uh, Eddie and <laughs> Oprah both know that I win. You know, he can just, uh, Look at the trophies, whatever. But this is more fun. I have more fun talking to both of them about this stuff. So, uh, yeah. We don't need to mention that. That's like a not talk. We don't need to talk about it. Mine was a low blow. Yours was way lower. Mine was lower? Yeah. You like Eminem saying, oh, I'm the best, best rapper in the world. Like, yeah, okay, fine. Get it. All right, we'll edit that out. <laughs> <laughs> that was too much. It was too much. <laughs> Take that out, yeah. <laughs> Cut it after Oberst goes to his low blow and we'll be done. <laughs> Give me a number, what do you want to try? What, what's your goal? Honestly, 25, bro. unbroken? 20, unbroken? I don't even know, I don't train Me like neither. Let's, let's just get a number for a goal. Yeah, it's not like, Let's say 20 unbroken. And then like, that's just, just an aiming point. Yeah, okay, 20. Fine, come on. 20 reps. Unbroken. Un un you're not a part of this conversation. I'm trying to be. <laughs> <laughs> I want in. <laughs> I did it. Let <laughs> me in. What are you doing? <laughs> yeah. Alright, let's go, buddy. Come Easy on. up. Come on. Let's go over. That's it. 
16. Good, come on. 17. Good. Come on, Roger. Come on! 19. One more, one more, one more. 20. Good. Jesus fucking Christ. 20 half reps, fucking brilliant. <laughs> I was awesome. Let's see, let's see you right now. Let's see you right now. Do 20. I couldn't, I couldn't do one more. Exactly. Right. Just change exactly. shoulders. Exactly. What do you think I just did? Fucking exactly. Right. Half reps. Exactly. In, in all honesty though, do you normally do you normally train like that? Like you're just trying to get the bottom pop going? I and do. not finish at the top. Basically. And then I do like I do locks, like like hold lockouts okay. on the heavier sets yeah. at the end. So you, you, you focus with something like this, it is more literally like off the chest. Off. Yeah. And this is basically like cardio, being comfortable with the weight on your chest with your heart beating. Okay. And then it's just a pop. So you get you got your heart rate up a little bit. Yeah. And then uh, Well you know what it's like when your heart's up, you're going for like the last rep in in the sixty seconds. Your heart's beating out of your chest and you put the log on it. Yeah. I try my best to replicate it. You can lock out without even getting it off the rack. <laughs> yeah, you're short. <laughs> I don't know if I can do one rep of this right now. <laughs> I don't think I could. We're, we think it's an 85 pound log, so what's that? 175, 265? So what's that? 120 kilos? No, like 115? Like 110? Alright. 20 half reps, I don't know. I'll probably do 4 reps. You're gonna do 24 reps, right? Well, I mean, if we are keeping track, if I do one full rep, I win, right? Yeah, pretty <laughs> much. Yeah. I don't know, I mean, you're kind of in my world, right? I've had this record for four years. That's a good point, actually. I'm just saying. What is, what is, is genuinely, genuinely, what is the American British log record? Two, 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 two twelve. Yeah. Who's pressed the Australian oak? The Austrian oak. Yes. For three reps. No, was it two? Tied. We tied. We tied for two or three. The, the year they. We both did it. We tied. For two or three reps. Two. I think it was two and a clean. They counted the cleans that year. Okay. It was one of the weird Arnold. Brian's years. got a good memory. I take drugs. <laughs> no memory. <laughs> I think it isn't it 212 though, honestly. It is 212. Is it 212 or 212? Oh, it's a kilo. What the yeah. fuck does a kilo matter? 2.2 pounds. 2.2 pounds. So I, pounds. So I, be, I beat you by one dude. kilo. I beat you by one kilo. That's all there is to it. I don't so believe you did. Literally, uh, did. A, a force, I think that's 465 or 460. 463? I think it's uh, that over. Number sounds familiar. 211 is 463, so it's almost 466. Okay. Yeah. It's weight. Like you just yeah. push it. I don't do maths. Like I work no, out. No, he just he just lifts weights. Let's not let's not judge him. Ju judgment free video. Yeah. <laughs> right? yeah. But with that, I can get tired. My heart rate's up, and I can keep that same line, the yeah. same. But um, it's also a forced quicker recovery. But it would probably be the same. In all honesty, it probably. Would be He's like, wait, where's the camera? Where's the camera? Yeah, I'm gonna stand right in the middle. Yeah. Yeah. Oh.
Come on. Perfect fucking reps. Let's go. Come on, B. Come on. Come on, Brian. Grab a hold of your heart and take control. Let's go. Come on. Come on, Brian. What you got in there? Let's go. What you got, B? What you got? Up. One. Two. Again. Come on. Three. Again. Too many of those. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what. Uh, uh, no. Too many of those. No, no. For me, I wouldn't have locked that many. <laughs> I, I just, I'm not used to. That's not. Uh, yeah. I can't. It's like I can't not lock that way. It's there. Oh. Yeah, that was. <sighs> got a nice little bit of cardio in. Got, got some lower press. I feel like that qualifies as CrossFit. Right? <laughs> that I not just do strongman and CrossFit. Basically. Hybrid. Work right. out. You should try and enter the games, basically, is what you're saying. Can, can, you, like, can your hands down walk? Easy, bro. Easy. It's like riding. <laughs> I'm about that life. <laughs> That's riding my wheelhouse. <laughs> I do that same. Yeah. <laughs> my legs get tired, I just flip over. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck, just doing that, I was cramping up. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's been a long day. It's, I'm, we're, we're making fun, but it's been like a 13 hour day on our feet, busting our ass. This is real work. Uh, yeah, yeah, that was, that was different. It's a good challenge. You know what I'm saying? It's, I'm just really not used to, like that line. Like I said, right. when I got tired, there was a couple in there where I, I did throw them forward. Yeah. But it's, uh, it's always, like you said, different log, different setting, different day, different challenge. It's all good stuff, man. I like that, like the over pump, like the, the it feels like it recovers everything faster. You know, I think that's originally why I started doing it like that, is because I was searching for that crazy pump. Yeah. I feel better tomorrow, I'll feel way better than if we didn't do that. Yeah, yeah. You know? No, it's a fun, it's, you gotta have fun with training, right? So you throw a different challenge out, different guy. Hey, I'm not gonna back down from it, you know? So, yeah. But I definitely won. No, oh, come on. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah. no, 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 no. I think you stopped at, at 16, 17. Yeah. Where, where the 17, Locked out or close to locked out. Locked off reps. Okay. But mine were, mine were. You're perfect, Brian. Perfect. Perfect, Brian. Perfect. But you did 17. And then five. I did 20. But, but. I'll let you guys decide. I'll let you decide. Yeah. Fine. So you can't Come. Back, you stop. And then you did five more. Right. But it was full. So you it get was one broken. So what's, what's, well, how many I get? 16 or 17? Something like that. Okay. Uh, the unbroken. But or the do I get more credit for the full reps or the twenty kind of? You sound like one of those Wilkes people. Like my body weight was lower and I didn't have quite enough calories and weights. Wait, bro, this is strong, man. This is strong, man. We twenty seventeen. If you would have deadlifted nine thousand pounds, but like if I got like eight hundred pounds, but it looked better, would it would it be better? Or which one? The strong man. I know he's trying I feel, to get into cross. I feel like he's trying to, he's, he's digging right now, is what he's doing. But I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what. For the internet, right now, half reps are becoming way too common. But this was on purpose. Oberst is doing this on purpose. That's the way he trains. He threw it out there to me. I just, I was even thinking about it when I was going, and I'm just so used to doing a full rep that I, I couldn't even do that. But it makes sense to throw it off your chest differently than you lock it out. So. Maybe it's something I could play with in the future if it'll make me better too. So, you know, you always got to be challenging yourself, doing different things, having fun. Uh, but uh, I think we're gonna, well, I think we're gonna wrap this up. We got to eat uh, a little bit behind on food, water, everything today. But I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed the video. We're sorry that Eddie had to be in it, unfortunately. But uh, you know, he at least uh, did his. I made the video basically. Did, got, like, the, uh, made the video disgusting just because of me. I knew it. You put me nail and you get more views. You know it. You know it. I know it. 
Wh whether or not these two guys like each other, at least I like both of them and it's fun. So I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. For now, go out and be great and we will check you later.